Hello, assalamu alaikum. So I'm gonna give you guys a review of my Golden Ghost sneakers. Um, I was looking to find more reviews of these shoes to see how other people feel. Um, and uh, on YouTube, I see people taking brand new shoes out of boxes to uh, to do videos of reviews, and that doesn't quite make sense to me because you gotta before you write a review, before you do a video on review. You have to wear the shoes. You try them on, tell how it feels. After wearing the first time, second time, third time, after a few days, few months, right? That would make more sense. I saw someone making a video and he's saying he bought the shoes for 400 some dollars just to do the video review. I mean, I thought that was useless. I, I wouldn't count his words for anything because he doesn't like the shoes. And he bought the shoes just to do the video. Well, what a waste of money and time uh, of his time and our time to watching that video. I didn't count his video. So this is uh, these shoes cost me almost seven hundred dollar with tax. I ordered from online, so they came directly from the uh, company warehouse, whatever it is, maybe Italy, uh, from Italy directly. And uh, I shipped it to the store, so this that saved me some shipping. Uh, uh, shipping money and they charge shipping costs that I thought was sad because I'm paying too much money for the shoe. Couldn't you offer me free shipping, right? Anyway, they offer free shipping to the store, so I went to the store and picked it up. And in terms of the quality of the shoes, they look good, right? Don't they look good? But just because they look good, I spent so much money to buy it. And not only that, they were also very popular. I like those studs, they look pretty. And another thing is, uh, were they comfortable? At the beginning, they were not comfortable. I, and I also cannot blame the shoe itself for, for the discomfort because I already have damaged feet from my, uh, from my boots. Uh, so my front of my feet hurts um, when I stand long hours. And also after watching some videos, uh, some people mentioned and or I learned also that the front, uh, the lining, the, do you call it lining? I don't know what you guys call it. This part of the bottom of the foot is slower to the front compared to the back, which puts pressure to the front of the foot. And I wish that wasn't the case because I would have liked a flat bottom so my feet doesn't hurt. It gets a little, little tight and little painful uh, but i wear them all day long and most of the time i'm just standing or walking around so it does become a little discomfortable but i don't mind it's pretty comfortable for me and um, you back up the shoe here it was hard it's still hard i wish it would break more and become more soft um, it took some time for this shoe to soften down. It's softer now than it was at the beginning. Anything else I want to tell you guys? Or anything else you should know? Hmm. Now, are they worth the money of almost $700? They look beautiful. I like them. That's one thing. They are quality leather shoes. That's another thing. Are they comfortable? Almost comfortable. I wouldn't say 100% comfortable. I have another pair of sneakers from Cloud brand that I got from Nordstrom. They're about $100 or something. I got them on sale. They're super comfortable, but what I don't like is that there, is enough, there isn't enough um, uh, lining at the bottom of the foot. Uh, but it's very comfortable compared to these ones. Uh, I can wear them all day long. I walk and so I wish this shoe was softer and more comfortable comparing to my cloud shoes. But these are still great shoes. Uh, I love them. They look really beautiful and pretty. What else should you know? Should you spend this much money to buy these shoes? It all depends. They got really nice, nice design and style shoes. Some people complain about these shoes uh, looking worn out. That's just a design. If you like it, you take it. If you don't like it, okay, just go away. You don't have to take it. <laughs> These ones are black leather. So, beside this white color looking a little worn out and the laces being darkish, everything else got no, basically, maybe a little bit here, there, 
distressed look of the leather maybe i don't really care it's all black you don't really recognize anything but it's yeah the shoes are pretty i would have liked to get a white one too maybe someday i will it's a lot it will cost me lots of money i think the one i'm interested to buy is over almost 600 dollar with the tax maybe all about 600 or more dollar with tax this is one of the most expensive not one of the most this is the most expensive pair of shoes i have in my life so far and i bought it like a incentive or reward for saving my job through taking vaccine which i hated to take which i was uh, forced to take to save my job that's only one that's the main reason i bought the shoes um, if i didn't take the vaccine would i buy it um, if i didn't me defense uh defense of my needs i wanted a comfortable pair of shoes and i'm happy to have this